Hi, I'm Talia, and for my new skill, I'm going to try and learn the basics of calligraphy. To start off, I tried writing in the style before I looked at any tutorials. This gave me a base level to start from. After this, I then started trying to practice the angles and strokes. As I started getting the hang of it, I thought I could start trying to form letters. I went on Instagram because that was where I first saw calligraphy videos. Lev Vygotsky's more knowledgeable other comes into play here. I found some quick tutorials from professionals that caught my eye and decided to give it a go. Vygotsky's more knowledgeable other refers to learning from someone of a higher understanding in regards to a particular skill. Vygotsky's theory of cognitive development is often referred to as a socio-cultural theory. Because of the letters on their own becoming a bit easy, I decided to try the full alphabet, which was slightly harder than what had, I had been doing. Again, Vygotsky's zone of proximal development is shown here by setting a goal for myself. It is slightly harder, so it pushes me to try my best and achieve my goals that I set. For me, a quiet and well-lit place is important to be able to be productive and motivated. Carl Rogers stressed the importance of a learning environment. John Watson, one of the main theorists that came up with the behaviourist theory, was also a believer in repetition in learning, which is how I am attempting to get the basics of calligraphy. Writing words and the alphabet over and over again to get better results each time I do it. Looking back on where I started to where I am now, I can see a difference in my writing, which was the goal. For me, the most effective way of learning was watching other people write and talk about their techniques and how they first learnt how to do calligraphy. This is because I am a very visual learner. All in all, I think I need a bit more practice.